Let's play. Welcome everyone to Metroid Prime, my newest Let's Play. Let's press the start button and already. Oh god, this game so good. <laughs> oh god. So here we are, new Let's Play. It's been a while since I've done one of these. <laughs> Let's go ahead and erase this first file here. Um, this is actually my second take of trying to record this because Audacity kind of pooped on me. So. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna just start a new game. Let's go ahead and pick. Uh, let's actually op options mode here. Uh, okay, we're good. Uh, normal mode. We're gonna play this on normal mode because, I mean, I am pretty good at this game. Uh, I just don't want to do this on hard mode because I think it would be too much. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna go start the game. I'll probably not talk about anything in the beginning. Just let you guys enjoy the music and have fun. Okay, this is just freaking badass. <laughs> Samus, why are you so awesome? <laughs> uh, ah, yeah. that music is so awesome. Ah. Alrighty, folks, here we are. Uh, this is the tutorial stages right here. I think it's called Frigate Orphan. As many of you know, this was one of the stages from uh, Super Smash Bros. Brawl, I believe. Uh, that's not until like later in the game, though, but you know what I mean. So the controls, uh, I'll kindly go over it for... I'm pretty sure most of you have played this game. If not, then what the hell have you been missing out? Alright, so let's go ahead and start. Uh, controls are A for shooting. Uh, you got your joystick to move around. and if you hold the uh, L button, you can do like some strafing action. Uh, if you hold the right button, then you can sort of uh, move your gun around at certain angles just to get to higher switches, just like this. Alright, so... By the way, I love that ship. I just do. I don't know, I think the other games, for the Metroid, uh, for the Metroid Prime series at least, I think that ship is overall my favorite out of all the three Metroid games. I mean, come on now. This is like my favorite Metroid Prime game of all times. So, we should be uh, celebrating the moments. <laughs> Alright. Let's go inside. Ooh. Chills from this place already. <laughs> okay, inside we go. Whoa, crap. This is so cool. Oh. I'm telling you, man. The designs of this level's or these graphics are just so amazing. Probably the best I've ever seen from any game in the GameCube industry. Oh, come on. Open the door. There we go. Ugh. 
So, what can I say about this place? Um, it's not really much of a small area, I don't think. Usually the first stages aren't, in my opinion. But here we got our first monsters. Um, I am possibly going to be doing 100% scan of everything. Um, because that's how I normally like to play this game, is collect everything. <laughs> and there's some pretty cool stuff if you uh, uh, collect all these things here and there. Alright, I'm probably not going to be uh, wasting my time scanning almost everything. But, uh, you know, there's some space pirates, there's that huge thing right there. You know, you know all the drill. I'm probably not going to explain much about this. You know, because as, as we see enemies, I'll, you know, I'll say what the names are here and there. And there's a lot of stuff too to scan, let me just say. This is just the beginning. <laughs> it really is. Alright, charge this! Now we gotta charge that. Boom, sucker! A uh, first cutscene. What could this possibly mean? All right, I guess that's sort of important. So let's go ahead and turn it to our morph ball here. All right, get inside the hole. Heh, <laughs> that's what she said. All right, so I wonder what this could be. Hmm, if that didn't already say so on the screen itself. You've downloaded the map for this area! <laughs> you got the map! No, just kidding, this isn't Zelda. Oh, by the way, um, I briefly want to mention this. I am not cancelling Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. It, it's been a while since I've recorded uh, Let's Plays, and school is just crazy like that, you know. I keep saying this, but it, it really is. <laughs> but Alright, let's just get out of this map here. So that's kind of the whole layout of the map here. I think there's some stuff here that we can kind of scan here. This is ta uh, Talonfar Ground Zero Area Secure. It'll kind of give you some information about uh, this place in general. Alright, well, I think you can pretty much just scan all this stuff later on. I normally just like to scan a few things at a time. And what's this? Access to deck beta approved. Alright, let's go up the elevator. Or down, I believe. <laughs> Going down? Man, I just love the elevators in this game. So freaking awesome. And, ah! Don't want to touch that, now do we? Let's go ahead and get small. So, this game will kind of feel quick in the beginning. But there's a lot of stuff to explore around here and there. Let's get this guy right up here. Those are just space pirates. Boom! You're dead. Haha. <laughs> Man, I don't think I've ever taken any damage yet. Because <laughs> I was going to possibly scan something. Alright, missiles! We can fire missiles with Y. And we've got uh, some missile turrets right here. Alright, let's see. Auto defense turrets with missiles to break out casting. Alright, let's go ahead and fire missile! And this thing right here you can actually scan, and that will be part of your research log. Uh, some of these things can be accessed from your start menu. If you ever want to look back at the uh, bog data, then go ahead and do that. Let's get rid of this missile. Missile away! Now there's some stuff we could possibly scan. Alright, there's a lot of things in here actually. <laughs> Let's see what that one is. Burn of defense turrets. That just basically turns off the the turrets here, which I've already destroyed. Now this red one right here indicates pirate data log. You'll see these throughout eh, most of the areas of the game. I'm probably not going to read all of this, but uh, this just gives you a basic idea of some things here and there about the frigates Orphean. Yeah, so there's kind of some backstory behind this game. I believe this took place bef um, after Super Metroid, if I'm not mistaken. And even Metroid Other M, I'm not really sure. But, oh my god, look at all these guys. Uh, then we got some Parasite Larva. That's all stuff that we'll probably see later on. Anyways, look at all this stuff we gotta scan. So much scanning! So much scanning in due time. Anyways, what we want to do here. Up the elevator we go. Ah! 
Monster! Alright, get rid of you. Bam! Oh, I took a hit. At last. Ugh! Die! Oh, come on. Just die already. Thank you. <laughs> it wouldn't go down without a fight. I like that. I like your spirit. And can I please get rid of you? Thank you. Now, these things, as many of you might know, are small energies. They replenish 10 of your energy units. And let's keep on moving. Alright, something tells me we got a sneak attack here. Aha! I saw this coming. <laughs> okay. This elevator I kind of like. It look, I mean, just look at this elevator right here. Oh, I'm telling you, I just love how this looks. <laughs> the whole reason why I love about this game, obviously, is the music. And as many of you know, I am a musician. I do play drums. And I'm just so fascinated. Oh, crap! Kamikaze! <laughs> These guys take out pretty quickly. If you play on hard mode, then the enemies get a lot tougher. So that's one reason why I don't want to do it. Alright, that door opens. Go inside here. Man, I got plenty of time left. I might show off the boss in this uh, stage here. Heck, I might even do that. Oh, crap. Turrets! Ah, oh, I've been hit. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead. We can pick up stuff with our charge beam. That's pretty nifty. Inside here, I think it's a safe station right here. Um, probably not going to be using it. Alright. And that obviously is um, part of our research. So, that's good. I think we're going to go ahead and take on the boss of this game. Or this level, I would say. <laughs> Alright. Since I know the first boss isn't going to be too bad. At least that's part of one what I remember. So here we are. <laughs> Can we just, like, enter as a morph ball? <laughs> and here we are. Now this was the part where they show this in the Smash Bros. Brawl stage, I believe, so that's pretty historic. <laughs> oh, hello, beastie. How are you doing this fine day? Are you going to eat me? You better not, because that would not be a great idea. Now wouldn't it? So here we are. We have the trusty Parasite Queen, I believe. Creatures, yes. Parasite Queen, Parasite Female. Generally enhanced by unknown means. And they'll pretty much just tell you like the weak spots of some enemies. Which in case, this boss is very easy. Look at this, I'm just firing rapidly. I would be cheap and just show off the missile trick. Like this. See that look at that, that just does so much damage and it makes this battle go by really quick. Uh you can sidestep really quick if you uh, hold the joystick and press the B button. Oh, I just, he's, he's almost dead, actually. And he's dead! Goodbye! That's right. Burn! <laughs> oh, what? He's still alive? Man, these bosses just don't go down easily now, do they? And kabooey! Uh-oh. Self-destruct. Where's the self-destruct button? Oh god, we gotta get out of here. We must get out of here. Alright. We've been time, so that's good. We got six minutes to escape. We could do this. Ugh, oh, no pressure, right? You know, all is good. We can get out of here alive, hopefully. If we don't have anything stupid coming in our way. Now we gotta go this way. Hurry! I think like this disables the turrets, so we can just skip by those guys easily. Ah! Oh. Holy bejeebies! Holy ho! That was crazy. Alright, let's get out of here. Up these stairs we go- Oh, hey! Hi, how are you doing, Mr. Space Pirate? Just die! God! I think I could've scanned him. Ah, oh, dang it. Is there another one? No, that's not it. There we go. Oh, those are just not really part of the mission, uh, the data lock here. Just die, come on. <laughs> like, really, you, you don't have a chance against Samus. Honestly. I'm 
best there is. Oh, we can pretty much just skip all this stuff. I think we got some more of those stupid parasite things. Yeah, that we pretty much scanned before. We just pretty much roll them. They don't do that much damage. Yeah, this more box section. Just make this quick. <laughs> I'm just telling you. I'm not like exactly speedrunning it, but you know. This is how I normally play the game. And if there's any problems with that, then so be it. Let's get out of here. No, it would be better if I had a certain item that we get later on in the game. That would kind of make things more speedy, if so. <laughs> okay. Door, please open. Thank you. Yeah, I'm telling you, the morph ball section will just make this go by really quick. Maybe not so much in, uh, in the hills parts, but you know what I mean. Okay. Turrets, get out of here. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just uh, currently escaping. Four minutes left. You know, I can possibly do this without you uh, shooting missiles at me. Oh god, not you guys again. Ah! Now, these pests are kind of annoying here. Look at that. They just put like goop all over my visors. That's so disgusting. That really is disgusting. I don't like that. You know, you guys are jerks. <laughs> and whoo! Oh, oh, that was a close one. Okay, Mr. Giant Thingy, I would like to get out of here, please. Thank you very much. Don't mind me, just, uh, <laughs> I'm surprised I'm staying calm for this moment. Like, come on. I'm pretty sure Samus would just be like, GET ME OUT OF HERE! <laughs> like, really? Oh, hello, cutscene. And what do we have here? GOOD GRAVY! It's, it's a giant metal bat! Actually, no, that's, uh, that's a thing that's later on. Uh, oh god, way to go. You know, they never make this easy for us, do they? It's just, that's, that's not great. <laughs> Anyways, looks like we can grapple along here. That's what those symbols are for. Alright, now there's something over here we can scan, I think. And what do we have here? Subject, Meta Ridley. Cerebral casting stable, el exoskeleton, surreal holding begin, uh, umbrial umbilical reactions. So, I guess we already know what our enemy is going to be up against. <laughs> so that kind of gives you a little information about Mr. Meta Ridley. Alright. Ah! Much acuted. Way to go, pal. Now, don't tell me. Oh, don't tell me. Oh no, my beautiful body! Oh damn it, now Sam's is all naked. How could you? Actually, yeah, how could you? Suit malfunction, morph ball malfunction, missile malfunction. God, what hasn't been malfunctioned? I thought everything in the future would work. <laughs> okay. Man, even in the future, nothing works here. All right, moving along here. Can't go out that way. That's all first to the flames. Room is depressurizing. All right, please let me out. Let me out. We've got two minutes left. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure we can make this. You know, we got this. Look at that. Oh, baby, we're free. Ugh, good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, there goes our birdie friend. Not birdie friend, just a bat. I, I, I'll call you Mr. Bat Guy, just because he just reminds me of a bat. Don't don't ask me why. You know, he's just a bat made of metal. He's got nice wings that are like really futuristic, like. <laughs> Ugh. Hey, why are you going to this planet? Well, yeah, I'm following you. Don't you dare escape me. Tracking on enemy target has been lost. Oh boy. We So we lost the bait. That's not good. So 
are now getting ready for crash landing on some mysterious planet. Talon Overworld. And there I am, looking all not so badass without my various suit. God, I just feel like I'm naked with this body armor. <laughs> and we will save the process here. Okay. So here we are on this strange planet. Known as Talon 4, I think. I think we can actually scan this now as part of research. There we go. Yep, there's our good old gunship. This is like my favorite. I think I've already said that, but... <laughs> Alright. I think we'll call this in the end of the episode. That was a pretty good chunk of stuff that just happened. Um, so, what I like to normally do for my Let's Plays is ask questions of the days just to get a little bit of uh, the discussion going on. Um, so my question of the day for you guys today is obviously, what's your favorite Metroid game? Obviously mine is this game, Metroid Prime, and then I would say my second favorite probably would be Super Metroid. Um, which in case, I still need to beat that game. I don't know why I keep avoiding it, but... <laughs> so anyways, I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed today's episode of Metroid Prime, the first episode. Give it a thumbs up, you know, do all that crazy stuff. Uh, subscribe for more, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, everybody. Peace out.